name's Taylor Knight. I'm the social media strategist for Bessie. How did you end up working in social media? I started working on Bessie's customer care team. At that time, we were kind of rotating. Every day, someone new was doing our social media comments and DMs. See, this is where I don't even know how to explain this. We needed just one person to really own it. So then my role went into more of like community management. Eventually, we wanted to bring TikTok in-house and then it turned into being Twitter and TikTok. Eventually now I'm doing all the platforms, which is a lot of fun. What previous experience best prepared you for your role in social media? So my program in university was like very relevant to social media. Um, it was called Creative Industries and it was like the business side of creative industries. It was a lot of like marketing social media for fashion, movie, music. It was definitely a bit of school and then also just like personal life. I just like being on social media. Pay transparency for social media managers has only been a topic of conversation recently. What do you think the average salary of a social media manager is and how much do you think they should actually make? Real question. That's a, yeah. It's tough. I think different companies have social media valued at a different level. So you might just have like a coordinator and that coordinator does everything or you might have like a bigger team where you have a manager and like people below them. What would you say <laughs> if I told you the average salary for an oh. social media manager was $36,000 a year? Okay, no, that can't be, it's actually what, what it is. That's way too low. When you look at the skills that we're doing on a day-to-day -day basis, it's like copywriting, creative direction, graphic design, customer service, really. I think it should be valued the same as like any other marketing position, like if not more, but <laughs> <laughs> What do you think a social media manager role will look like in five years? I don't know, and I would be shocked if anyone has a concrete answer for this. It looks so different now compared to what it was five years ago, even like a couple years ago. I think in terms of trends, community management is definitely a bigger part of the role. I think like more brands are realizing you have to be a human, like humanize the brand on social and treat it as more of a creator as opposed to a company that's showing up on social. Candidly, how many times have you demoed pouring water on shoes for a shoot? I, I can't count that. It's too many times. A lot. It's part of the job. Great okay. job. Nice. And you're a winner. Thanks no, so much. we drink.